welcome to my kitchen I'm Eva today I'm going to show you how to make a souvlaki everybody's favorite souvlaki you can make it with uh, three types of meat you can take it a, um, a little bit more expensive the pork tenderloin or you can do it with a breast of chicken if you rather have chicken it's done it's very nice with a breast of chicken or you can do it with a a pork shoulder okay for more economic or if you have a party and you have a lot to do it's a very pork shoulder is good it's mostly what you eat when you're outside when you buy a souvlaki it's probably made with a pork shoulder I myself I'm gonna make it with a pork tenderloin so you cut it into pieces now don't cut it into big pieces because pork is gotta cook right through Okay, it's done. So you put it in a bowl, okay? The meat for souvlaki, it's gotta be marinated for at least 24 hours. Even more is better. To marinate it, we have, we start with fresh garlic. You take your uh, squeezer and you squeeze a clove of garlic, okay? Then you take uh, olive oil, okay, olive oil. You take um, pepper. Now the pepper and that it's your, to your taste. You season it to your taste. Salt, and you use a little extra oregano. Oregano is really nice, and it makes it really, really tasty. Then you take your uh, lemon and you squeeze about two tablespoons of lemon juice, and uh, then you mix it all up. I'm sorry I used my hands, I've already washed my hands and everything. And then you put it on your meat, okay? You put it on your meat, all of it. Well, we didn't use the wine, we didn't use wine. So we gotta use about uh, a half a glass of wine, okay? Then you put it all over the meat, like this, and you work at it so it goes all over the meat, okay, like that. Then you put a cover, you put a cover on it and you put it in your fridge for at least 24 hours at least. Now the meat has been marinated and it's ready for the skewers. Uh, we already done one, so we're on the second one. You just continue doing it till you finish all your meat. Now it depends if you're gonna ask me how much meat to buy. Well, it depends on your family, it depends how many people you are, okay? And even if it's, uh, you make a few extra and it's leftover, it's good for uh, leftovers and for the next day, it's very good. Spring is coming, time for to fire up the barbecue, which we did today. We got it nice and hot, so uh, we clean it up good, we, we uh, have it nice and warm, so here is a, a souvlaki, we're just going to put it on. And we're, we're going to let it cook really good because pork, it's got to be really cooked really, really good. And right now it's on high, so we're going to turn it to the medium heat. And we're going to be around and see if in, in case the flame comes up or anything but uh, it should cook very nicely. The souvlakis are ready with rice and a nice salad and a tzatziki sauce and you have a very nice meal. Kaliores.